Did you know that there's gold in your SIM card? There's actually gold wire and gold contact strips built right into them. Now, admittedly, there's not enough for one SIM card to make you rich. They wouldn't be designed that way, but here is how to extract it. You'll need a 68% nitric acid solution mixed one to one with water to separate the gold from the contact area of the SIM card. And then to separate the gold sheet mixed with PVC SIM cards, you can use a colander and then wash them with water. And you can see now, after being left in that solution for a long time, the waters will run through here over a colander and just check out what ends up on top. Now, while it might look impressive, that's just phase one. What you'll need to do now is make yourselves an aqua regia acid. It's used to make the gold pure. It's a mixture of nitric acid and hydrochloric acid mixed at a ratio of one to three. And you can see now it's being poured over all of that golden looking powder that was extracted from the SIM cards. And over time, what you'll get is a muddy looking sludge or powder. It looks almost black. That is your gold dust. That's the important stuff. Now on a low heat, dry it out. And when you're ready to try to melt what you've got into a small cube, well, then you can use some borax powder and sprinkle that over top while either using induction heating or a torch like this. And it might take a few goes and a few rounds of sprinkling that powder on and sprinkling in your black gold dust until the whole thing forms one solid. And as you can see here, it took two or three rounds of that heat and more powder, heat and more powder, adding that gold dust until incredibly, it starts to solidify. But don't think you're gonna get rich pulling that one SIM card out of your phone. Check this out. That is a tiny fragment. Then cleaned up in some of that sodium metabisulfate and measured. That's not a lot. In fact, to get one ounce of gold, it would take 56,000 SIM cards.